Greetings to all obedience worldwide and um, I want to show you some set of videos, very short videos that will help you in these times that you don't know what's actually happening in the country. The election disappointed us, INEC disappointed us, APC disappointed us, the federal government disappointed us. But let me tell you, there's always light at the end of the tunnel, very bright light. We are not giving up, Peter Obi is not giving up and we are fighting this to the end till Peter Obi becomes the president of Nigeria. Fighting and winning this government is, has never been easy. But we are going to fight to the end and we our victory will be ours. Make sure you like, make sure you comment on this video and make sure you share this video for other obedience to see and be encouraged. This Electoral Act as amended just last year states in section 60 by the way that transmission of election results shall be done in a manner as determined only by the chairman of INEC. The chairman of INEC then by himself released the guidelines and regulations for the 2023 elections in which he stated that transmission of results from the polling units shall be done via the BVAS system. Okay, that's the portal, the uh, website, everything that he put there. Election happened. The chairman of INEC now came later after election that had already happened you know, and said, sorry, oh, I know I said that this is the way that we do it, but what happened is that our system was hacked. And as a result, we can't do it like this. Okay. Okay, no, that's okay. No problem. Let's even assume your system is actually hacked. The normal thing to do in a circumstance, or let me say the fair thing to do in any circumstance is okay. I said we'll do it this way, but my system has been hacked. So how about we do it again? The chairman of INEC said, no, 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 don't worry. Let's just carry on like that. I have the result. You have the result from where? Greatest Nigeria youth. Smile now, I beg, I beg, smile. Because we have a lot to smile about and I'll tell you some of them. Never again in Nigeria will anyone undermine the influence of the Nigerian youths. Because never again in this country will anyone underestimate the power that the young people have. That is what happened. The power that the people have was hugely underestimated all in the name of the structure this somewhere all in the name of oh now some people where yeah, get that power no if there's anything this time has taught us it is that the power belongs to you and it belongs to me it belongs to us the power belongs to the people nigerian youths have come out and we have demystified their structure we have started what we cannot finish but we must finish it nigerian youth you have started something greater than even you yourselves something that can deliver us from now and for generations to come. Please, don't be demoralized. Oh yes, because I know a lot of people are, while some other people are, are happy. That is very fine. That is the beauty of democracy. I've said the times without number, that everybody has the right to support whoever it is that they want to support. But we are gradually getting to a place, we are gradually getting to the time where only the sheer will of the people will prevail. So please, I want to beg you, calm down. Don't give up. Don't lose hope. Now that lose hope, they want. So that you go there, you go just say, oh, nothing can ever work. No, it don't work. If nothing can ever work, this momentum where we even gather, it no go possible. Oh, yes. Uh -uh. When the election, they hurt. One politician, he come, he say, hey, who are the youths? They can vote whoever it is that they want to vote for now. And the youths came out and they did vote. Oh no, not only the youth, the people came out. Everybody came out. Everybody vote for who you want. But at the end of the day, we can see, we all can see that the youths have that power. That we young people have that power. We get the numbers now. Come on. We get the numbers. So Don't forget one thing. We won this election. You came out and you made the statement loud and clear. You won this election, so don't beat yourself and be say, oh, if what? No, you won this. The people who are used to violence are rigging are the ones that should be ashamed of themselves. And let me tell you something. You have no business being depressed. You have no business being disappointed. You have no business saying, oh, I don't want to go at this one. I am weak, weak. Okay? Now, now we start to. Now, now the matter starts. Now, now we go. Now, how they want an anai start. But you know one thing? <laughs> it's not what they expect we do at all, at all. We are going to do this thing. 
and fight and get our mandate back by using that legitimate means possible all around. This time now, you have to start gathering evidence wherever you are. Your polling unit, you deliver your polling unit now and they want to take it away. No, you have your sheet, you have your paper, you have the picture, put it somewhere. You have videos, pack them somewhere because we we'll gather all the evidence we need. They either do the needful and give her the results of the original how it was, not the one that after night, after swapping. No, the way the people voted. Oh, we take that result. We'll go all the way. We'll follow it all the way. So don't get angry. Don't get uh, depressed. I see some people are saying that, eh, Supreme Court, they have done this. They've done that before when Nigeria's eyes were not on them. Now the Nigerian eyes are on them. Kenya did something. It's not Kenya. It's not that country. Kenya, I think it was, that came out and stopped the election and said, no, this thing wasn't done. So now that the citizens are invested, the Supreme Court will know to do the needful. So everything that needs to be done will be done. Don't bother. We are watching this. We are watching the result. The beavers that were supposed to be, the beavers all of a sudden it didn't work. The IRA, go and check. Check the results are supposed to be there, polling unit by polling unit. The one that does, I have my, one of my polling units. You too, you have. Who go and check it. The one that doesn't match, we say, no, this was not what we did. Because we are the ones that voted. It wasn't INEC that voted. INEC with business was just to collate. We voted. And we know what we voted. And we will follow our vote. How do we will follow up. That's our mandate. If they try to steal it, they steal it. We will follow every legitimate thing. That the Supreme Court has been doing anyhow, does not mean they will continue to do anyhow. This time, they will do the right thing. Everyone will do the right thing. All we ask for is for the right thing to be done all over. Unfortunately, Anek has not given us the right thing. But we wait as we go on. So, stay on. Don't be, and don't be depressed. Don't be angry. Don't be this thing. All you need to do, gather every evidence. All of us, so we are going to be witness. We'll be showing up wherever they want us to show up. Thank you.